Uswap is a decentralized proprietary exchange with its own token, the Yumi. And with me to explain more about this is the CEO, Andreas Kartrude, the CEO founder also of Uswap. So great to have you here. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Absolutely. It's my pleasure to be here. So give me an overview of Uswap. All right, so so Uswap is a decentralized exchange uh, which is launched onto the Tron uh, blockchain, meaning that it's a smart contract protocol that allows people to swap TRC20 tokens uh, instantly between each other without the need of uh, a third party like a centralized exchange, so to say. Okay, so that was going to be my next question. And we hear the word decentralized exchange. Can you kind of explain for people that are just learning about this? What's the big difference between a decentralized exchange and a centralized exchange? Of course, yeah. So let's start with a centralized exchange because most of the people know how they work. So with a centralized exchange, you need to register an account. Uh, most often you do your KYC, you need to deposit into a certain wallet. Uh, you make your trades, it's an order book. Then if you need, if you want to add crypto out again, you need to withdraw it back to your wallet. So you're not in, in, in complete control, so to say, over your cryptocurrencies or your assets. They are being held by the, the exchange. That's the centralized exchange. Now, a decentralized exchange is built upon smart contracts and it executes the same things that a centralized exchange does, uh, simply that it does it automatically. So it, rather than having uh, a central wallet uh, and then you have the, the the founders or the workers at that exchange who is now dealing with with all the, with the trades and with the deposits and withdrawals, everything is handled through smart contracts. So you're eliminating that middleman. Okay, so truly peer to peer, it sounds like. Truly peer to peer, yeah. exactly. Okay, now what co tokens can you swap on Uswap? Well, on Uswap, currently you can swap, well, more or less any TRC20 token. Uh, the thing is, we have limited it in the beginning. So the first seven, uh, eight months, we've actually only listed the, um, what we say, the verified tokens from the Tron Foundation. So there's, there's thousands of to tokens on the Tron network as well, but there's only a few that is actually within the Tron Foundation, and we uh, focused on these tokens. Right now we have, uh, today actually, we launched the uh, the first IDO launch pad uh, onto the Tron network. So we're now taking uh, applications from other projects and other developers that are listing their tokens, but it needs to be a TRC20 token, which operates on the Tron blockchain. Okay. Now for some people, and I know there's been a lot of interest in crypto over the past year, so even more so than before, if somebody wants to start, how do they even get started with Uswap? Well, the well, first and foremost, to get started with Uswap, you need to have a Tron wallet. So the, the recommended one is TronLink or Clever Wallet. Uh, these two wallets can interact with smart contracts. So what you do is you just go to the URL of Uswap, which is uswap.me. Uh, you paste that into the DAP browser. If you're using uh, your desktop, you have TronLink, so it will automatically connect. And what happens when you go to the exchange or to use swap is that you will connect with the wallet and automatically you can now interact with uh, with the smart contract swap pools. So you can simply uh, select the tokens you want to swap or if you want to provide liquidity to start farming. Uh, so it's actually a very, very simple way to do. We actually have or we are in the making and we also have already uh, uh, well, educational videos on how to download TronLink, uh, how to connect with Uswap, how to exchange on Uswap, how to provide liquidity and a lot more stuff. Because we we know that simplicity uh, is one of the key factors in order to have a mass, ad a mass adoption. Yeah. So for us to have new users instead of rather only experienced users coming to us, we of course want to educate the new community so that they can learn the basics and learn more uh, to interact with the, the, the services. Yeah, I think that's really important. Um, so you mentioned Yumi, the token um, and the farming of it. So kind of explain what all you can do with Yumi, staking, farming, talk, talk me through that whole process. Of course, of course. So there's a lot. There's a lot you can do with Yumi. So as you say, Yumi is the proprietary governance token over the use of Dex Exchange. Uh, you can, well, the first uh, use case that UME has is to govern the, well, certain parts of the development of Uswap. Which directions are we going? Are we going to add this? Uh, do we need a, a new burning function? What, do, what, what is, do, does the community want? Mm -hmm. And the way to, to get the UME is actually through providing liquidity to the Uswap DEX exchange and then staking your LP tokens. Now, for those who are not familiar with what this is, is 
you're providing two types of cryptocurrency to the exchange uh, into a smart into the smart contract so that other people can use those uh, assets to trade and swap with and you get uh, what we call the liquidity pool token and this one you can use to uh, to farm you and me with okay. so simply by uh, providing liquidity, allowing other people to swap and trade and use Uswap as an exchange, you can farm you and me for free and accumulate those coin tokens. Okay. And you also receive as a, a share of the swap fee on the Uswap exchange as well. Interesting. So what is the potential, would you say, for Uswap going forward? Well, um, I would like to say it's unlimited because the, their Uswap DEX differs a little bit from every other DEX that is out there because um, when we talk about a swap, usually it's only a DEX. Now, Uswap is much more than a decentralized exchange as well. We also, as I said, we just launched the first uh, IDO launchpad, which is an initial DEX offering. It is uh, a new way of, uh, what can we say, not fundraising, but launching your token project and having a committed and engaged community that is, is ongoing already. Uh, we are also launching the first NFT marketplace, the public NFT marketplace on Tron. So any, any uh, developer or any user that is creating a TRC721 token in a standard motion will be able to use our um, marketplace to either create, bid, buy, sell uh, NFTs uh, from all over the world. Now, you and me plays a major role in all of this. So you can farm you and me for free by simply providing liquidity to the exchange. Now, with the UME, you can either you can farm more UME, you can participate in IDOs because the only way to actually uh, buy into the uh, to the initial Dex offering and the pre-sale is by using UME. Now, also the NFT marketplace is connected with UME, so all uh, bidding and all selling will be in UME. That will be the native currency. Thank you so much, Andreas, for coming and sharing that, and best of luck. And feel free to come back and update us when. Um, as the summer goes on and you have more features. Oh, absolutely. I would love to. We, we are, you know, the next couple of weeks, we're launching uh, a lot of services and we are listing a lot of new tokens. So it would be a pleasure to come back. And thank you so much for having me on.